In his message for Lent this year, Pope Francis reminds us that mercy is a gift from God that we are not to keep to ourselves, but which we must share with others. He wrote, God's mercy transforms human hearts. It enables us, through the experience of a faithful love, to be merciful in turn. In an ever new miracle, divine mercy shines forth in our lives, inspiring each of us to love our neighbor. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and that's certainly the message we hear today in the Gospel at Mass from Matthew chapter 5, part of the Sermon on the Mount. Jesus says it's not enough to not kill another person, but if we harbor angry, hateful thoughts towards others and talk about them and call them names to their faces or behind their backs, then we are, in his words, liable to judgment, liable to fiery Gehenna, which was an image he used for hell. Lack of charity, in other words, is serious business. As St. John wrote in his first letter, you can't say you love God and go on hating others. Why? Because if you really loved God, you would love what God loves, and that's your neighbor or your enemy. That's everyone God created and everyone Jesus shed his precious blood for. To hate others in any way tramples on the blood that was shed for their salvation. So if you find yourself with negative feelings toward another, don't nurse them into bitterness and don't talk about that person. Rather, turn the negative into a positive by praying for him or her, asking God to bless them with the grace of conversion.